So again, we're still here at Drive Electric Northern Colorado. I'm here with John Dellenbaugh here at Dellenbaugh Chevrolet in Fort Collins. And uh, John, obviously this is this is a huge event for electric vehicles, right? Yeah, you know, we're really just celebrating Drive Electric's one year anniversary and it's just been awesome to be a part of the community. And they're just really intertwined with everyone's forward thinking and getting the chargers in. And our sales for the region and our dealership have been considerably over last year and the national average. So it's something that's just positive for our community community and Dellenbaugh Motors is really happy to be a part of it. That's great. What would you say is the single biggest advantage to driving an electric car? Well, number one, not paying for gas, <laughs> yeah. but uh, you know, more than anything, I think just being, uh, you know, treading lightly on the environment, um, you know, having less footprint, less dependence on oil, and overall, it's just fun to drive. You have a lot more torque and uh, it's quiet. See, and that's a good point because a lot of people think you won't have enough power, you won't have any torque. So what are some of the most common, I guess, myths you've heard about the electric car that you could just debunk right here, right now? Well, the first thing is it doesn't feel like a golf cart. Uh, it feels like a normal car, it's very fast, uh, it has a higher torque ratio, so it's gonna get up and go faster. Um, you know, another thing is gonna be range anxiety. Now, some vehicles are strictly electric, meaning they have a specific range that, uh, once it's out of juice, it's done. So uh, the advantage with the Volt is you don't have the range anxiety. All you do is if you run out of batteries, it turns into a gas-powered vehicle over 30 miles a gallon. So you can drive this uh, from here to California, no problem. And uh, you know you can work on your electric range on the way there, and then once you're out of juice, just turn on to the gas motor and you're set to go. Right, and, and so something like the Volt doesn't have a traditional combustion engine, it just has the a generator, right? Exactly, it's a generator and it's gonna keep the batteries powered up and keep you rolling down the road. So cool. Well, that's, that's pretty much all there is to it. Drive electric Northern Colorado, this is what it's all about.